and uh, Lily and Lulu were, uh, were found safe. Uh, very excited, many, many hours uh, went into uh, ensuring that these girls were, were found safe. And like I said earlier, our whole goal was to, to bring these, uh, to these two sisters home. Um, so approximately 7.30 p.m. Mountain Time, a Los Animas County Sheriff, which is right, in, right around Trinidad, um, based off a tip or going off a tip that was received, um, that the subjects were in that area, uh, went looking for the vehicle or the subjects, came across those subjects, uh, uh, the vehicle uh, in that area on the roadway, pulled in behind that vehicle. Um, vehicle started driving erratically. Uh, he waited for his backup to arrive, initiated a high risk traffic stop, um, and Terry Miles uh, was taken into custody without incident. The two girls were located inside the vehicle. Um, they both were unharmed and uh, safe at that time. The girls will be transported to the hospital and checked medically. Uh, Terry Miles will be held in custody. I do have two of our detectives who will be flying out to that area in the morning uh, to conduct interviews uh, at that time. Um, and Child Protective Services in Colorado and in Texas will be working on getting the girls home at some point uh, in the near future and getting them uh, um, reacquainted with or back to their families. I can't thank uh, these folks that are behind me and everybody who's worked so hard day in and day out on this case to bring these girls home. I want to thank specifically the FBI, the U.S. Marshals, Texas Rangers, Central Texas Violent Crimes Task Force, the Williamson County District Attorney's Office, United States Attorney's Office, National Center for Missing and Exploited Children, Child Protective Services, Colorado Law Enforcement, the men and women of Round Rock Police Department who just worked tirelessly on this case, and all the citizens who called in tips to help uh, us come to a resolution on, on these missing uh, uh, sisters.